Good afternoon, Johnny Rev Gamers. Thank you for your patience. Today we're going to be doing part three video of infantry charge procedure. Specifically, going to be covering when a unit can counter charge a unit that's charging them or another unit, uh, which is covered on page 48. And then we'll also be covering when a unit is charged while forming, if marked form or if not marked form, which is on page 44. The setup on the table is illustrated on page 48 of a counter charge situation in the Johnny Reb 3 rulebook. In this situation, the Union Mark C was going to charge the unit in disorder and formation change, but because they be, they came within six inches of this unit on hold, this unit could counter charge to try and save that unit from getting charged. If charged, a non-charging infant unit may, depending on its orders, make a counter charge. If marked hold, if a visible charge comes within six inches, a holding unit may counter charge. And this is the procedure of how it may counter charge, either in good order or in disorder. If marked hold, as this one is, and that unit came within six inches, the holding unit will attempt to beat its BMP, basic morale point, with one die which is called a tactical competence roll. Officer present does help this roll, a minus one if an officer was present with them. If it does pass the test, it may counter charge in order. In this case, they could counter charge in line. If not, the counter charge is made in disorder. So, in, in this instance, if it was a veteran unit with one die, they would have to roll above a three in order to pass and counter charge in good order. So let's roll. They did not, so they would counter charge the charge unit in disorder. If they had passed, they would counter charge in good order. When the counter charge occurs, the two units will meet halfway. I have nine inches here between the two. They would meet directly in the middle at four and a half inches. The counter charging unit stops at the point of impact if they win. If the charging unit wins, they would continue on their bonus movement. Now, if this unit was marked move and the charging unit was charging the that unit, the infantry may counter charge, but the counter charge is done totally in disorder, and you would not have to do any rolls. They would just meet them head on. However, let me point out that as if this unit was charging a unit marked move. In the previous instance, because holds go before movement, the hold unit could counter charge to try to stop the charge unit from hitting this unit that was on formation change. Also, if the charging unit is countercharged by unit, the attacker immediately reacts to the countercharge unit and the countercharge now becomes the main target of the charge. If this causes the charging unit to change direction by more than 45 degrees, it is thrown in disorder. So, for instance, if this unit had been over beyond the 45 degree angle of that unit marked charge, this unit could would charge toward the counter charge unit, but because it's outside the 45, they would that would be in disorder. Now, let's go to page 44. What happens when a unit is charged while forming. Charge while forming is not good, but depending on the orders given, the quality of the troops, and how far away the charge begins, the defender, if he is lucky, still might prevail. So 
So in this situation, let's first do formation change, or if there are any other formation besides this order. But for this example, here is how that's done. If marked form, as this one is, and the intended formation change takes only half a movement, which it does for form veterans or elites, remember it takes a full movement for a disordered unit, skirmishers, unit in the woods, rough terrain, or green troops to form. So if it was in only took half movement for our former veterans and elites, then if the charge impacts in the later half of the total movement of the charge unit, charging unit, I'm sorry, the formation is considered to have formed and can face the charge with no impact morale detriment. For instance, if this unit's full charge was 12 inches, this unit would automatically form into the formation they want if it was anything over 6 inches away. Now, if the intended formation would take a full turn, like I mentioned, being the disorder, skirmisher, unit in woods, rough terrain, or green troops, and the impact occurred in the first half, or if the impact occurred in the first half of the charge movement, then the defender must roll one die, attempting to beat its BMP, which is the basic morale point, also called a tactical competence roll, to see if he is able to form line. Officer present does help. So in this instance, if it was within the first half, let's say it was six inches or less, if going by what I stated before, if the charge was a full 12 inches, they would roll one die to see if they passed. In this case, they did, because the veteran union is a normal morale of three, and they rolled a five, they would pass. So they can form line before impact. If they did not, for instance, roll a two, they would stay in disorder when they get impacted by the charging unit. So that's if marked form. Uh, one other aspect of this that I want to cover is if the defender is successful, he forms and faces the enemy that's charging and continues with the charge resolution with all the firing and impact morale modifiers, but while charged on forming. So remember that you lose a dice when you're forming and all the other impact modifiers. I believe, for instance, the impact for forming is a plus two on impact. Now, if this unit, for instance, was like this in any formation and mark move, okay, not marked form. Well, let's go back for one second on the previous thing. If the defender was unsuccessful, he would fall in disorder and continues to charge resolution in disorder, suffering all the fire and impact modifiers of disorder, which is a plus four on impact, if that had been the case here where they failed the form. Now, going to if a unit was marked, move. First thing they would do is go to condition hold. The defendant unit goes to condition hold and must first see if it successfully changes formation to face the charge. It must roll higher than its BMP with one dice. No modifiers except officer present can be used. So again, in this instance, they would go to condition hold, they'd roll one dice, the BMP here is three, with an officer it would be two minus one for the officer, so I'd roll. They were successful so they could change formation to face the charge directly. However, if the defender was successful, he does form face the enemy and continues to charge resolution with all the firing and impact morale modifiers of both charged while forming and condition hold, which on impact is a plus two for formation change and a plus two for condition hold. If the defender is unsuccessful, let's say he rolled a two, 
and did not roll above a three. He falls into disorder. And continues to charge resolution in disorder. And suffers all the firing and impact morale penalties for both being in disorder, which is a plus four, and condition hold, which is a plus two. So when they got hit, they would be a plus six versus the unit that's charging. Again, that is covered very clearly on page 44 on charge while forming, if marked form or if not marked form, and on page 88, countercharging. One other aspect of what we just covered of charge while forming, if marked form or if not marked form, if the charge began closer than four inches away, all of it's mute. In that case, it's assumed there's no time to form. The defender receives the charge in the formation and the position he began in. If and only if the defender was in line and hold, could he react by refusing one stand, which may mitigate to some degree the situation he is. Or even if the charge started farther than four inches away, if he did not become visible before it closed within four inches, then this rule would apply. Again, pages 48 for countercharge, pages 44 for when you're charged while forming, if marked form or if not marked form. Thank you very much. We'll see you in the next video.